Now here we're going to uh, examine some of the data before we do any processing of it. So let's, um, let's open up Rapid Miner, uh, go to your repository window. We're going to go with the um, the downloaded CSV file, but it doesn't matter. It's any any file. So double click it. That will uh, run the uh, run the data and open up the example set. Okay, so you got three little guys up here. You got your uh, your process viewer. And you got your uh, results workspace, and then you got your your open uh, open dialog. So results workspace, click on example set tab. This shows you the met meta metadata. Um, tells you how many rows there are, special attributes, regular attributes. Okay, so it's got your role. These are all regular. Uh, got the name of the attributes since they were unnamed in the original file. The type, um, and then the statistics. So you got your mode. Uh, since it's all nominal data, I just got mode uh, and you get a range and some ones as well. So that can be useful. Uh, just for getting a basic idea of your data. Uh, data view looks at the actual data. And then plot view lets you plot data. So a couple useful ones are histogram. So attribute one. Okay. Now let's see, look at um, basically the dis distribution of the one attribute or field and if you want to compare a couple attributes together there's a scatter plot so we'll have maybe attribute 2 versus attribute 3 and you see there's a bit of a question there between the two okay and you can also do a scatter matrix okay and you have any, uh, as, as you have uh, which is like an idea of, of which ones are might be important okay and you can uh, import the image as well Put that to my Vancouver data folder. Um, so I wanted to do that as a uh, PNG file. Okay, and that'll uh, export to the folder. And I forgot to give it an extension, but we'll just change it to PNG. You can up in your browser and, you know, add that to a document or print it as well. So that's pretty useful. It's pretty much automatic matrix, scatter, scatter plot matrix generation as well as histograms, which is a lot faster than in Excel. Uh, and that's about it for basic examination of data.